It's the second year I've attended this conference. Um, I came last year and really enjoyed it. The number one, really, with any of these events, I think, is for teachers. It's just to meet other people in the same situation as you. So there's, there's always great things and you pick up loads of tips and tricks, but the bottom line is just meeting people and, and, and networking and uh, meeting all those right people from the, you know, the SRO office. I've got a personal interest in science and we do an astronomy GCSE, so I'm hoping that this can help me network, meet other schools that are doing that and incorporate some of the excellent stuff we've done today into our day-to-day -day lessons. I'm really interested and passionate about space and I'm just looking for ways to bring space into the classroom both for mathematics and for the sciences so I wanted to see some of the teachers involved here and what they had to say about education and how um, the how space would fit in from an educational standpoint and how it fits in with the curriculum. It's nice to uh, see people from research um, and actually get involved with them and hear from their point of view uh, the work that they're doing and how we can incorporate that in our everyday teaching. I think space reaches out to people in a number of different ways. I mean, it's that exploration of our boundaries, pushing the boundaries, pushing the frontiers. You have this wonderful platform and a wonderful opportunity, the International Space Station and what we're doing in space. You have that as a means of educating people about why we're flying to space and to get them excited about, uh, about what we're doing and excited about science. So it's only natural to tie, and tie the two things together and reach out to uh, you know, use the space as an educational outreach tool. Today's been really inspiring. It's been useful because we get to meet lots of other people. We get um, a look not just at um, the applications of our subject but also um, some of the wider science behind um, space. By using space as the inspiration then you can draw hooks to whichever subject you happen to be teaching, whether it be maths or science or uh, physics, chemistry, biology. All of that is occurring right now on board the International Space Station. So there are hooks into space that can help students relate to what they're doing and what they're studying back on Earth. It's trying to make something that I love interesting when I'm teaching it to younger people. And uh, this kind of conference gives me that kind of information and that kind of push to, to make a difference.